Oh, thanks everyone. You guys, are, you guys having fun today? Yeah. yeah. Is this more fun than school? Yeah. I don't like teachers very much. I don't like them. I think they're too bossy. Have you ever had to go to the library and deal with the librarians? Put your hands up if you've ever had to go to the library. I think the librarians are the grumpiest people in the whole world. Yeah. Aren't they? Yeah. They're always old and they always go, shh, 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 shh. That's, that's all they do. There was like, shush, quiet, quiet, quiet. And they say, where's my two straight lines? Where did you draw these lines? Um, <laughs> they, they always want you lining up and quiet. And at my school, when I, I went to school, if you got in trouble in class, they sent you to the library, right? And when you got there, the librarian would say, and what are you here for? And I'd say, oh, I was talking in class and I threw a paper and that, the librarian would go, shh, no talking in the library. I'd be like, but you asked me what I did. Made me very mad, very, very mad. Who here does um, sport at school? Put your hand up and play sport. Good on you. PE teachers are a bit grumpy. I find them a little bit grumpy, aren't they? They like to yell, don't they, sometimes? Do you want to see my impression of a, of a PE teacher? Yeah. yeah? Okay, I'll do it for you. Here we go. Well, we're going to go up the aisle, we're going to go around things, we're going to swap back around, okay? Because you guys got to warm up, you've got to be nice and warm, okay? We've got to stretch, we've got to do lots of running today, okay? So we're going to do big stretches, okay? We've got to get the basketball out, we've got to play basketball. A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B. <laughs> I couldn't understand the PE teacher. You can never understand them. They're, and, and you always have to have a note to get out of doing sport, don't you? You have to get your parents to write you a note. And the PE teachers always look at the note like this, like it's just all lies, always like, no, 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 no. They always think you're making it up. But why would you? Why would you make it up? Because sport's fun, isn't it? It's better than maths. Yeah. Yes, it is, I reckon. Maths teachers always give you some to do like this. They always write, if David had five TVs, and Michelle came and took four of David's TVs, how many TVs would there be left? One. But do you know what I would write on my test? I'd write, that's a robbery. You can't just take someone's TVs. That's stealing. That's not very nice. <laughs> and that's how I got this job. OK. Do you like old people? Yeah. yeah? What do you reckon old people smell like, though? Put your hand up and tell me what you reckon they smell like. Yep. Fish, yep, yeah, what else do old people smell like? Old people, <laughs> yeah. But old people, you know what they always want to do? They always want to kiss you, don't they? Yeah, they always want to come here and give me a kiss. Come on, give your nana a kiss. They always want to give you a kiss. They always try and kiss you right on the mouth, don't they? Yuck. And your mum's always like, go and give nana a kiss. Give nana a kiss. Who likes actually kissing their nana? Put your hand up if you love kissing your nana. Yep, three of you, that's it. It's not fun, is it? You know when your nana's got a moustache? Yeah? Yeah. Do you want to see my impression of an old person? Yeah. Okay. Okay. This is an old lady, okay? Yes, well, hello, everybody. I'm very old. You see, I'm so old. When I was a kid, we only did... We didn't even eat food. All we had to eat was coal. Um, do you guys want to see an impression of a magpie? Do you guys know what a magpie is? Yeah. Okay. Okay, I'll do my impression of a magpie for you. And if you close your eyes, close your eyes, everyone close your eyes, that you will think there is a magpie in this room. Okay, ready? Here we go. How good is that? That is spot on, isn't it? Who has a dog here? Put your hand up if you've got a dog. I've got a dog. I'll show you what my dog's face looks like. It looks like this. <laughs> She's pretty good. She's a big dog. She weighs 45 kilos. She's, yeah. That's the same as me. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> um, all right. I'm going to tell you another thing about school. Who, who here, when they go to school, hates it when the teachers want to keep you in at lunchtime? Yes. That is the worst, isn't it? That is the worst. And they always say the same thing, don't they? They always go, well, it's your own time you've wasted. It's not, you know, it's not my lunchtime. And they always say, I've got nowhere to be. I've got nowhere to be. That's because you probably don't because you're a teacher. You've got nowhere to go. You're not going on a date, are you? Not with those clothes. Um, who here at their school 
has someone that they have a crush on. Does anyone, does anyone here like, like any boys or like any girls? Does anyone want to come up on stage and say hello to the person that they like? <laughs> and you can say hello to them on the telly, yeah? Batman? Yep, come up here, champ. What's your name? What's your name? Otis. Otis. Come, come over here, Otis. Hi, Otis. And what, what do you want to say to the person you like at, at, at your school? Two. <laughs> Otis, do your best fart noise. <laughs> That's amazing. A big round of applause for Otis. Thank you. You can sit down. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for listening. Um, th my name has been Mel Buttle. Uh, see you later.